This video shows how to determine if newly installed Wavelink's devices are operational and ready for configuration. A Wavelink system may consist of many different types of devices. All Wavelink systems will have at least one wireless area controller to coordinate communications between the connected devices. Other Wavelink devices in the system may include fixtures with integrated sensors, tile-mounted sensors, switch packs that are connected to switched or 0 to 10 volt loads, receptacles, battery-operated ceiling sensors, and wall stations. Each device has either diagnostic LED indicators or out-of-the-box programmed behaviors that show that the device is ready for configuration. If a device does not show the proper behavior described in this video, refer to the Wavelink's user or troubleshooting guide for further information. Start the verification process at the wireless area controller location. First, apply power to the wireless area controller and wait approximately one minute for the controller to initialize. Confirm that the wireless area controller's Eaton logo LED is illuminated. Verify that the blue 802.15.4 LED on the rear panel is on. Next, make sure that power is applied to the circuits connected to the Wavelink's devices. Out in the space, walk under each fixture with integrated sensor or towel-mounted sensor and confirm that the lighting is on or turns on with the motion activity. Look at each sensor and confirm that the LED in the sensor's lens blinks green with the motion activity. Next, verify operation of Wavelink's relay switch packs. After power is applied, check that loads connected to relay switch packs turn on and remain on. Next, verify Wavelink's receptacles. After the connected circuit is powered, verify that the receptacle's green LED is illuminated. Next, verify the battery-operated ceiling sensors. Confirm that the red LED next to the sensor window flashes approximately once every 10 seconds. Lastly, verify Wavelink's wall stations. At each wall station, press any wall station button that has an LED indicator. The LED on that button will flash slowly for approximately 10 seconds and then stop. The verification of Wavelink's device installation is complete. The Wavelink system is now ready for the construction grouping process discussed in the next video.